Hello everyone from Ekaterinburg. As you know before, in Soviet times, this city was called Sverdlovsk in honor of the politician Jacob Sverdlov. Yekaterinburg has its square name, streets, avenues but this is not the most important thing, Sverdlovsk always considered the capital of such directions in architecture like constructivism. Many preserved buildings, monuments in this style of style. He was always loyal to this kind of art, progressive, modern even now in modern Ekaterinburg residential complexes are being built, they are called the names of the great avant-garde artists Malevich, Kandinsky, Tatlin. Therefore, this I want to show you a movie in Yekaterinburg constructivist show those same architectural monuments tell their story while they are still preserved. Some are very deplorable condition. Some restored, residential buildings people still do not live. Therefore, let us go. Constructivism is a direction in architecture, developed after World War I due to the growth of industrial technology, the introduction of new types of buildings, structures. In Soviet architecture constructivism dominated at the end 20s early 30s. Its main features are functional expediency geometric sharpness of volumes, sharp composition dynamics, and long stripes fastenings, tape windows. By her own simplicity of new architectural forms contacted their functionally constructive justification. With utilitarian as if the optical load was removed. A figurative idea was derived from social maintenance of the structure. Constructivists considered the main task of the architect organization of a new life. Architectural construction activity is almost completely discontinued 18 to 20 th years in Yekaterinburg in the late 20s reborn in the form of a construction boom. Fateful for the city, now Sverdlovsk, was the decision of the Congress of the All-Union Communist Party of Bolsheviks, in 1925, on socialist industrialization country, in whose program, Sverdlovsk was intended special place, new administrative status center of a large industrial region Russia, committed to transformation its buildings. The district executive committee decided about redevelopment of the central part cities. Sverdlovsk architecture of the constructivism style adopted unique architectural legacy, despite the fact that in 1934, about 100 buildings and complexes were not completed due to the administrative collapse of the then Ural region. In addition, how consequence of a decrease in funding. 1930s Sverdlovsk in a sense was experimental lab nationwide construction. Not for nothing, UNESCO identified Yekaterinburg as a reserve constructivism. In this movie I want imagine a few buildings in my look, the most prominent representatives of this style. Everything will be natural further continuation. Enjoy while. P.S. The track of our walk will be in description of this video. Also on this all points will be marked on the track. All objects of constructivism that we showed you today. City center, street intersection Lunacharsky and Lenin Avenue. Here are two objects constructivism as a former club builder's former Sverdlovsk film studio, now shopping center city center and dominant, the so-called town Czechist's Iset Hotel, currently time former dormitory young NKVD employees. To the hostel, as well as to the town Czechist's we will return, and now our path lies with the builder's club. The years of construction of the club 1929-1933. It is believed that it was designed in kind of tractor, but again official there is no confirmation of this version. Building, a vivid example of the club building of the late 20s years. Open balcony and wide stairs, transitions and completely ruined in our days interior space, up unrecognizable distorted by small shops. Facade of the building to fortunately manage to save, in almost unchanged. True clean geometric volumes owners use under outdoor advertising. The building is divided into two parts, spectacular assembly hall, in the inner part of the courtyard and club placed in two elongated volumes. Club had steam heating, a buffet, a theater, cinema, various sections and circles. In the war years in Sverdlovskaya studio. 
The building was originally not intended for these purposes, so at the first opportunity interiors began to change. In 1944 in the rear, Sverdlovsk was filmed first film, musical comedy, by motives of the Austrian operetta, Silva. The difficult post-war studio was in desolation. Widely known film studio received in the 50s-70s of the last century thanks to an innovative search in the field non-fiction documentary. One of the most noteworthy projects Alexei Fedorchenko's studio debut feature film, the film, First Days on the Moon. Telling the story of preparation launch to the moon of the first Soviet spaceship with man on board. Hello. New series of videos. Hello everyone, a new series of our videos on the Ural cities and the cities of the surrounding areas. We will walk, show you interesting places. Collect rating of these places. Therefore, you travel. This is the courtyard of a movie studio. From the courtyard of the Sverdlovsk Film Studio we find ourselves in the courtyard of a residential complex Gospromorals houses located along address Lenin Street 5254. Architects Valenkov, Karatkov, with the participation of Gorshkov, created these houses in 1935. The complex includes nine residential buildings, polyclinic, kindergarten and administrative building. Take a walk in the courtyard of the residential complex. Residential complex acting, ordinary people live in at our city. First line of houses Gospromoral, at 52 Lenin Street, was completed in 1934. Were four residential buildings of two types commissioned floor plans, each six floors high. In internal cases used corridor sectional planning system, and in the buildings overlooking Sonia Morozova, Bazov Street, the apartments are two level. On the main avenue of the city, Avenue Lenin's houses of the State Industry Committee come out end faces rather than ceremonial facades, showing off popular in the early 30s. The principle of line building. Building ends raised on columns. Second turn houses located at 54 Lenin Street and it has five residential buildings. Three of them facing the Lenin Avenue, united by the building of the clinic. Three houses built in the western part of the complex, were commissioned in 1932, the two remaining were completed in the years 1932-1936. We approach the club named after Dzerzhinsky, included in the complex of the town Czechists. Now here is a museum of history and archaeology of the Urals. In addition, here the dining room was located where gathered tenants of the town. Interesting that the menu read on the internal radio. The inhabitants of the complex got into the dining room from their homes, on a special transition and a spiral staircase, preserved to this day. General staircase the club is one of the few details Soviet-era interior constructivism, preserved to our days almost intact. Beam overlap here forms a five-pointed star and the staircase itself contrary to unwritten architectural rules twisted counterclockwise. Unfortunately, the club is currently closed, therefore, you can only see the stairs in the photo, and somehow necessarily I will take it to you on video. City of Czechists, a complex of buildings in the very the center of Yekaterinburg, built by the project of architects Antonov, Sokolov in the years 1929-1936, originally wore name of the residential complex of the NKVD, popularly received the name Czechist Town. Project provided for the creation of a large-scale system of utilities and household purpose. Residential buildings cultural institutions, medical service and preschool education. The working houses of the commune were considered during the years of Soviet rule as an important social achievement, generated by the initiative of the working masses. Workers felt it necessary to fix injustice in the distribution of housing and rejected the whole old way of life. According to the commandments of collectivization, Soviet the person had to bathe in public baths, dine in the factory kitchen, therefore. 
The main feature of these houses is the lack of kitchens and bathrooms. Facade and Main Entrance Museum, aka Dzerzhinsky Club. Left, behind the glass, there is the same staircase. The architectural dominant of the town of Czechists made in the form of a semicircle, Shiaiset Hotel, a former hostel hotel type. Seen from above, its body has recognizable sickle shape and the adjacent house of culture named after Sergo Ordjana Kidza, now the building Ural Museum, guess the hammer. Official confirmation of project meaning has never been. However, you yourself can appreciate it or not looking at the map. In addition, here is a monument to that same Jacob Sverdlov, in whose honor is named Yekaterinburg. The monument is installed in square opposite the Opera House. House of the Press, she is printing house, Ural worker, years built 1929 to 1930 years. The building was built according to the project of Golubev, which later took over as chief architect Sverdlovsk. Tape windows, along the entire length of the building, a pillared rounded facade and outside staircases buildings in semicircular glazed in full the height of the glasses. These constructive features became subsequently classic, for style. During the Great World War II, the inhabitants of the building had to make room and free room for evacuated riders. It is in these walls in wartime Agnia Barto, Lev Castle, Alexei Novikov Priboy and many others worked. We continue to move along Lenin Street inside of the city pond. Soon, the Ural Snab Torg building will appear to our right. This is an example of an incomplete integrated building quarter. Date 1935 Office buildings on Lenin Avenue Karl Liebknecht Crossroads and Overlook Main Avenue on the opposite side of the quarter was supposed place and residential buildings. At the heart of the building two-story brick building of the end of 19th century. The Communications House, aka the General Post Office, is located two blocks from the town of Czechists. Built his tractor form to glorify the peasantry, collectivization and collective farms commissioned by the People's Commissariat of Communications. Over the project worked architects Solomon, Sokolov. In 1933, they designed not just the main Sverdlovsk mail the premises were built kindergarten, nursery, radio theater with 800 seats, where it was possible to relax culturally, and listen last news. The building housed long-distance post office telephone exchange, Telegraph. In a separate housing located automatic telephone exchange on 10,000 subscriber numbers covering largest city institutions of the capital Ural and residential buildings of the central region cities. Its main function is mail performs so far. On the opposite side of Lenin Avenue the first house of the Sverdlovsk City Council. The first five-story apartment building with hairdressers and shops, built by the Sverdlovsk City Council on the place of historical development of the city. Date of construction 1928. UNIHMA building in Chemist's Lane and adjacent to him the laboratory building of Severokin. In 1920 was executed pilot project that combined in one quarter housing and experienced chemical production. The complex included P-shaped in plan residential building and laboratory building. The building was built for the Ural Chemical Research Institute. Facades decorated by the project architect Dombowski. Years of construction 1930. It should be noted that, angular placement of the building, receptions organization of the main entrance, natural basement lighting influenced for spatial solution ground floor. Entrance to the building is shifted to the outer corner and is located below the first floors, the volume of which is taken out along the line supporting wall of the tranchy pit basement and partially rounded. In the neighborhood is a residential building Old Bolsheviks one of the buildings of the unrealized complex Old Bolsheviks. According to the project, it included four residential buildings, club, dining room, laundry, kindergarten. Years of construction 1933, designs Antonov, Weiss.
On the opposite side is the residential complex of the NKVD, house security officer, he is the second house of the city council. Year built 1928-1932. The complex was built commissioned by the NKVD, consists of two residential houses four-story P-shaped building, adjoining its eastern building of the 11-story tower. The tower house was the first multi-story building in the Urals, equipped with two elevators. Corner balconies on the 10th and 11th floors are now lost. We are with you move to the street Volodarsky. Residential building Araustroikohoza. The house is located in the quarter between the square 1905 Volodarsky Lane and Street 8 Martha. Five-story stone and figurative in plan buildings with the western facade longest wing overlook the red line east side of the street Volodarsky. The second wing is extended in the depth of the quarter. In addition, facing the street facade to the north. Year built 1936. We see the second house of the city council, he is the Czechist's house, from the side of the street Volodarsky. By the way, Boris had an apartment in this house Nikolaevich Yeltsin, first president of Russia. The building was reconstructed in 1928 year, earlier the building had a different appointment. The building is located in the central part of the city. Represents a multi-story volume, complex in plan. As a compositional dominant, the rounded corner part protrudes clear rhythm of windows, non-geometric horizontal and vertical structure articulation of the facade plane. Say it again. Where? In addition, here it is. This is tightened building grid, this is the club of Softorgservice employees Profintern Culture House. He certainly looked more presentable in due time. Now tightened with film, meshed because which is completely in a ruined state. In general, while we are walking here, we ourselves understand because, here, we probably never were, with cognitive and we figure out which house is which of them, and the house where Boris Yeltsin lived is second house of councils, total in Yekaterinburg there were five such complexes. Five houses, apartment complexes councils. The building was built in 1926 to 1928 years, according to the project of architect Garayev Durevich. In the 19th century at this place there was a one-story building in the spirit classicism, a guest yard. He stood more than a century and burned out during a fire in 1902 year. Gostini Devor began to rebuild. Art Nouveau, but World War I prevented war and then revolution. Later already, the built-in honor of the new building was used in the construction business house for Prombank. Many office building projects of the future Greater Sverdlovsk, were developed in in the framework of the all-union competitions the first of them was held in 1925 on the building of Prombank. In the competition Ural Moscow, architects participated located here for many years famous children's clothing store and school goods Leopold famous to every Sverdlovsk citizen. Office House, Historical and Architectural Monument. Built in Sverdlovsk in 1929. Located at the intersection of streets and March 8 and Malashov. Architects Valenkov, Smirnov. Office House was erected to accommodate shopping enterprises and the Union Bank of Agricultural Business Operation. The building has four floors on the first window served as shop windows. Spectacular rounded corner, the object got typical, for constructivism traits, solid ribbon glazing and long facade. DOSAAF building site, House of Defense, selected in the area of the old administrative center of the city. In place of a market located around Church of the Great Martyr Maximilian. The sports complex was allocated a quarter border along Malashova Street, March 8. Year built in 1934, it was at this time, began 30s, peak construction of sports facilities in Yekaterinburg. Initially, the project was very impressive, in addition to the club and sports college designed the residential sector, sports hall, spectacular pavilion. It was planned that the complex will occupy the entire quarter, and the architectural dominant will be giant dome to sit under stadium. Fully realize the project is not succeeded, limited to a club, training case. As a result, the club building decided perform in your favorite form constructivists in the form of a ship. From the street Malashova really reminds him. 
Like this, he is a Katrenberg style constructivism. If you liked it, you will definitely continue because in one movie to accommodate all the objects is impossible. Just I will definitely be shooting. Show you all this. Required subscribe to my channel. Links to other videos will still be somewhere here are the tips. What else to say? I would be very happy for some comments, especially those who looked almost to end who saw Lenin necessarily comment below. Bye bye.